Hi everybody, this is John Abel. It's April 24th, 2015. Um, I got my ultrasonic vaporizer working again. Uh, just uh, I wanted to show you guys uh, real quick how this thing functions. And you can kind of see the, ultra, uh, the ultrasonic anti-gravity effect that happens as, as it pushes through the water and will actually cause the water to come um, and rise out of, of the surface tension of the top of the uh, of the top of the uh, the rest of the water. So you can see here there is a little floater, a uh, styrofoam floater, uh, and that's just simply to turn the uh, auto turn the machine on and off. And uh, the piezo buzzer is down underneath the water there. So when I turn this on, it'll start um, uh, trying to put a vibration through that speaker. And uh, so we'll try this here, and you'll see that it's actually pushing the water up above the level of the surface. So if I turn it up, I have a dial here, so if you turn it way up, uh, you know, it really heats up the water. So, you know, there's this, there's this heat um, presence that, that happens as well. So it's not just um, s s turning the water into vapor, but it's actually heating it up as well. So I wanted to just show everybody this, how this functions. Works well with distilled water, not so well with tap water for certain entanglement reasons. But um, I, I think this is um, a good way to look at uh, making environments, um, breathable environments. If you're going to talk about uh, working on spacecraft or living in space, you, you are going to have to create your own environment. So there, this is one way to do it. I just thought I'd show this to everybody. So good luck on your experiments.